I said to myself, this year, no more coats. So your girl bought some more coats. So my winter haul, bits and bobs here and there, things that I bought recently, some things that I just added into the video because they came later. So some things might have been in the sale, which I'm gonna add into the video. We wanna get the real deals, so I literally have wait. I'm waiting till like January, I'm, I'm good. Like I don't wanna spend my money on things I know that I'm just getting because it's it's gone down the sale. Will I have bought it if the price was the sale price originally? Gotta think about that. I did say in my last video, no more coats, you know. We're gonna keep rotating on, you know, our old coats, but they've been some nice coats though, this season. So I did get a few, some were gifted, some I'm working with brands, so some of them were gifted, but I do have a fair share. So I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna try them on for you. It's gonna be a chit chat, try on haul. So if you wanna see what I bought, keep on watching. This coat, like, I'm so mad that it's actually sold out, but I was trying to find alternative. This coat did so well on my Instagram. It was such a like, blas basic, such a basic all black look. Maybe I should do a lot more like black, just plain black look. Ignore the white top underneath, like I would wear it all black, but I just wanted to show you where I still have this on with the black trousers. But yeah, like, love it, love it. This coat is literally one of my favorites. And this is from PLT. It's an aviator style coat, and I absolutely love it. Absolutely, absolutely love it. And the shearling, oh, it feels so warm. It's obviously faux leather, not real leather, but I, mean, I think I got mine a medium for a bit of a, nails are just literally breaking, for a bit of an oversized feel. And I wear them with these boots. Wanna be Doc Martens, and these are also from Pretty Little Thing. They're like patent as well. I feel like if you have like big feet, six, seven, eight going up, like these kind of boots make you look like you've got like clown feet. Uh, but we move. This is the look. Love it. You can obviously put the color up like this. This is complete. It's a complete look. Absolutely love it. And then going back to Boohoo, I spotted this jacket in the menswear and I was like I gotta have it it's got like a little buckle thing going on got this color up here and then the bigger one and just zipping it up it just looks so cute I think I got like a large in this because I wanted it oversized probably change the boots I mean you can keep the boots but I'll probably go for like something brown I could either go for my Louis Jordan looking trainers or my Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton desert lace up boots. Get your hand on it if you like it. And then there is this one from Boohoo, which if you watched my Instagram like coats lookbook, I did feature this. I was wearing it differently though. I did have like an all white thing going on. But today I thought, let me show you with the blue jeans. Absolutely love it. It feels like I'm wearing a duvet. The one that I showed you on Instagram was a size 12. This is a size 16 or 14. I actually prefer it a lot more oversized. So you can wear it like without the belt or you can wear it with the belt. If it's gonna get really cold, then you can belt it up. But I love it. Like I love like, it just feels like I'm wearing a duvet. I've been literally eyeing the black version of this. I've been like refreshing the page constantly. It keeps selling out so quickly. I would love to get the black one. Yeah, this one also goes in and out of stock, but I will put the link to it. There is a petite version as well, if you want the pink, like the shorter version, but honestly, I would go for the long because it is pretty cool though. It is pretty cool. So I'm adding a couple more things to the video because they just literally came. I have this coat, which again, dying. So many coats, guys, I know. I feel like when it comes to winter, you can, we wear things from like the last year, but you know, coats, you never can go wrong. So this coat is from PLT. Again, part of like the puffer style trend. Absolutely love it. I don't have shoes on or trainers on, so just like show you. I absolutely love this coat, guys. Like, it's like a pop of color. It isn't your typical winter color, but it's like, bam, like out there. And I absolutely love it, like, honestly. I got this in a 10 because I wanted a slight oversized feel. So you can go a lot bigger if you want, but I'm a 5'7 and this is where it gets to me. And this is like the little detail, got this little like popper 
buttons on the side, it's got pockets as well. I cannot wait to put this on and style it. I also picked up these joggers from PLT. I also have them in the grey as well. I got them in black like a long time ago and I really like them. I love this like this popper detail. It kind of cinches in the waist as well. I got mine in an 8 and this was in a 10. This was the only one that was left in a 10. But I feel like the 8 looks better even though I do like baggy joggers. But this it's literally sold out. This is going to be like my airport fit. I might wear it with like a crop top though as opposed to a bodysuit. Just depends. I don't know. We'll see. Also, I have this coat again from PLT, which you know to pair with it. I wouldn't wear it to the airport, obviously, but like on a normal like winter day, this is like a normal look that could work. This I got in a size eight. I could probably have gone for a bigger size. I prefer it like draped like this as opposed to wearing it on, just because like it's. I would have preferred it a lot more oversized. But I also forgot this jacket as well. I got this crop puffer jacket also from PLT and I got it in medium I feel like it goes really well with this with the bottoms yeah you can style this however you want definitely a lot more casual I would say and then we have this black coat another faux fur coat from PLT this one I got in a size 10 so it's quite oversized I kind of thought it would be fine as a 10 but it's a little bit over too oversized for the particular style but yeah so this is what it looks like and then obviously it's belted so you can belt it up. It does feel really warm. It feels quite luxurious. I'm probably gonna wear mine with like thigh high boots and like a mini dress. I would probably stick to your own size just cause I feel like it's already kind of slightly oversized. So I would stick to your size. But yeah, this is really cute. You literally cannot have enough black coats. You can't have enough. We have another one from ASOS which is this coat right here. I think this comes in a tall as well. I got it in a tall. It's like a very, very warm, it's a warm material coat. So it's extremely like, it's even scratching my skin. It's, that's how warm it is. So what I was gonna pair it with were these boots from Simi Shoes. They're from the Anna and Mandy Cavalli, the Cavalli sisters from Love Island. They're a little collaboration with Simi Shoes. And I got these boots. I actually have another pair coming, I don't know where it is. It's a thigh high boot, I don't know why it's taking so long and I chose next to delivery. But they look like this, let me just go a little bit closer to show you. They've got like, they've got like studs um, on one side of it in black and they're lace ups. But they also have like, it's a chunky heel as well and it's got a zip. So if you don't want to have to lace up your boots every time, they've got the heels. Um, they've got the zip. This could be like a really nice coat for work, you know? Real cute, really warm, extremely warm, so definitely like you can definitely be warm in this. I love it. So if you're like my height, I love to get, like I said, I love to get tall coats. If you're like my height, then I get tall. We've got some more boots up in here. We have these ones from Boohoo. They've got like little gems and stuff, and they're just ankle lace up boots, but they also have a zip on the side as well. Let me just grab a coat. This coat I also got from Pretty to Little Thing. Clearly I'm really into like puffer jackets and coats, but I really like this one just because it just, the color, the style, I kind of wish it was a little bit longer, but yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, I would wear this with trainers actually, not with boots, but you can wear it however you want. They don't have pockets, which are, which is kind of inconvenient, but yeah, this is literally what it looks like. Yeah, absolutely love it. I got it in a 10. You can obviously go up if you want more of, a, more of an oversized feel, but I absolutely love it. I'm going to pair this with. Probably going to wear a beanie with this as well. You know, something like this. You know, I hope you can even see, see that. But yeah, that's literally how I would style it. You know, again, black trainers. Probably my Balenciagas. Or you can wear it with the Doc Martens looking boots. What do you think? This coat we have from Boohoo. I'm literally doing it in like random order. This is in a size 16 and I actually like it as this size because it looks more like oversized. I feel like the eight or the 10 wouldn't look like this. So it was, I got it in a 16. I mean, it was literally all they had left. <coughs> so um, yeah, it's so warm. It's very furry. It's definitely like a nice like 
oversized teddy fur coat. I absolutely love it. If I don't see it or find out Boohoo, there's so many different like alternatives. I will link for you. Where will I be wearing this to? I mean, it's white. I feel like I'm gonna get it dirty so quickly. I already have like the the collar's already dirty, but um, yeah, this coat, guys, is literally coat of dreams. Obviously, I wouldn't wear it with like black jeans, but so I wanted to put it on and show you. But I absolutely love this one. Like, love it. Let me put some shoes on. This is just an example, you know. But no, this is absolutely gorgeous. It's from the premium collection and misguided. All white fur coat, very, very luxurious, very, very glam, very night evening wear off to the theater. These boots are also from Boohoo as well. So if you're looking for like white chunky boots, you can check out Boohoo. I think PLT have them as well. But like looking like a bin bag today, you know. I don't know, I feel like I really like this, guys. I kind of like it. I could probably pull this up, you know. I feel like you can make it fashion. And you'll make it fashion. So this is from PLT, by the way. I think this could work, honestly. I think it can work. So <laughs> let me know what you think. Got this jumper from Missy Empire. I kind of wanted it in black, but I couldn't find the black <laughs> until after I'd ordered it. So I got the khaki instead, which is kind of cute. It's got like a kind of like oversized, it's like kind of like the fisherman's, fisherman's cable knit <laughs> style. Um, you can wear this with jeans, leggings, liver trousers, however you want. Okay, so I want to show you these boots. I was, again, very late to the game on these boots because I just didn't see them anywhere. When I did discover them, they had sold out. Um, they are the Prada Monolith boots I said to myself let me go and check the price I said will I wear this on a regular basis regardless of the name regardless of the brand will I wear this regularly can I see myself rocking these boots to death I was kind of like in two minds and I feel like if when it comes to designer if I'm in two minds about something I usually wouldn't get them I will try and find an alternative and I was able to find an alternative I actually have two options so I first ordered it on Aliexpress. Let me tell you about Aliexpress. Let me tell you about Aliexpress. They don't get away with a lot of stuff on there, but um, for the girl who doesn't want to spend too much money, or you want to try out something before you buy the real thing, like a plain item without the brand name, but the same style, whatever, that's all good. The thing about Aliexpress, yeah, they become, they're really testing my patience, so I, I chose DHL to send obviously I wanted it quicker 7 to 15 days the guy came back and said oh they can't do DHL because they'll leave it or hold it at customs he changed it to e-packet if you're familiar with Aliexpress e-packet takes about 20 to 45 days I ain't got time for that I got things to be doing not pictures to shoot so he said oh let me ship it with EMS bear in mind I paid a certain amount of money on shipping to get it quicker so how are you now changing my shipping option but not refunding me my money. Do you, get, do you get what I mean? So anyway, he, he eventually shipped to EMS. Again, should have been seven to 15 days. It took a month to get here. A month. So within that time, I was thinking, maybe this guy might be a scam because it's taking too long. I read some of the comments and some of them were saying they didn't get their items and stuff like that. I'm like, hmm, I don't want the sound of this one. No. I don't want the sound of it. Anyway, eventually came and it looked like this. But in, in that time, I'd gone on to Jessica Berman, who also do a lot of like, spot on I'm gonna have a bag to show you spot on inspired items design items and I have them both and look at the quality I honestly prefer the Jessica Berman and it came in a few days like I would say like four days like tops they were quick the DHL was quick so I don't know I now have two pairs but I do want to sell my Aliexpress one but if, I wish I could show you like the quality they are so different first of all this came folded up no box nothing just chucked in into like a plastic bag this came in a box and it had stuffing inside like it was so stuffed inside and the, the leather is not creased the leather on here it feels like i've worn it like for like five months so let me show you an example this even stands up this stands up this like it flim is flim you can tell you can tell the difference in quality i think i paid like 90 something dollars for this and a hundred and something dollars for this but honestly the extra money makes a difference. I hope I'm in focus because honestly I can't see a thing. 
But yeah, these are the two. So the one on the left is the AliExpress. This is the one from Jessica Berman. You could, probably can't tell. Look at the um, le the leather. It looks worn. The leather looks worn already compared to this. Look at how smooth that is compared to this. Like it's just a lot more flimsy. This is a lot more smooth and sturdy. I feel like they were just in a rush. Even these little things were just so no no shape, just flimsy. So I'm gonna try on the Jessica Berman one because they just look much nicer. But I'm obsessed. This is definitely a bargain for me. For what it is, I feel like I wouldn't spend that much. So let me cut this off actually. So these are what the boots look like. They absolutely like I absolutely love them. I absolutely love them. The quality is ridiculous. The quality is insane. They look like the real thing, honestly. And they just feel a lot more sturdy than the AliExpress ones. So I will definitely be selling that, selling those ones. I can even look. I'm looking at them now. I'm just like, what are these? They literally were in a rush making them. But I get excited when it comes to high-end things, and they don't last very long, like the, the hype. So I'd rather not pay too much for something. I know that I'm gonna like get bored of really easily. But I love them. I can't wait to style them. Um, but yeah, this jumper, again, Miss, uh, Missy Empire, they've got a few colours. I have it in this colour too, and it's a small medium, and they're currently on sale, I think, as well. This one is one of my favourites, again, from ASOS. It gives me, like, hobo chic vibes. I probably wouldn't wear it with a grey top, but just show you what it looks like on. I definitely do, like, an all-black vibe. And uh, I absolutely love this coat. I really hope I'm in focus. Absolutely love this coat. And um, again, with a probably with a beanie as well. Warm material. I love how like thick. Let me just make sure I'm in shot. Am I in shot? Is this thing on? <laughs> I love how thick like this the sleeves are. It really helps to have like short hair because everything is just quick to style. Like in, a, in the winter, you, don't, you just don't need to style your hair, honestly, because you're gonna be in like hats and beanies. And but this is uh, this is the coat. Love it. There aren't any there are no buttons, so it's literally like free flowing, very warm. Like literally, you'll be sweating in this, and I just love it. That's pretty much it for the video, guys. I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you saw something you like. And um, this is gonna be it for me for winter. I think you can. I think you can agree with me in saying that I'm set. I think I'm set. You're all set. So um, all I do is literally like I just kind of like rewear different things, mix and match. You know, I'm very very casual these days. If I had to pick between casual and glam, I'd probably just do casual like my joggers, you know, my hoodies, stuff like that. So these things you can wear like in different ways with heels or with trainers or with boots, however you want it. But hopefully you get some inspiration from this video. But thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.